all. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm just thinking about the National Guard in each and every state of the United States. <laughs> Why don't you get me their state funding and their federal funding and their actual assets, the properties that they say that they have? <laughs> and then any and all equipment and the employees for the last 60 years? Yes. <laughs> now, when I email the National Guard and I document, yes, that my rights are being violated as a resident of the state of Washington and they don't defend the civil rights of American citizens. <laughs> they don't defend the Constitution. <laughs> I can sue the Army, just so you know, but it's a lot easier to sue each and every state National Guard because of their obligation <clears throat> for having to defend the state constitutions. Now, yesterday... <laughs> I mentioned maybe we should have some court hearings where the world could watch if they wanted to, though they don't have to. <laughs> this whole concept of state National Guards and state ooh, National Guard Reservists, yes. I know that you thought you needed all that equipment, but I thought I'd have it. <laughs> At one point, I offered to purchase all your old equipment, and then I'd have some sort of surplus business. <laughs> Today, I'm thinking I will sue you for it. Yes. Now, when you refuse to defend the state constitutions that guarantees that no one will be deprived of their life, liberty, or property without due process... <laughs> And I email the National Guard thousands of times in this state and other states of the of the nation. Yes, it looks to me like you really don't you don't think I can do what I can do, but I can. Yes, the National Guard is actually required to defend each and every state constitution, and you decided you wouldn't because you're the fucking National Guard. Well, as the American citizen right now. I will sue you for every fucking asset of every National Guard in every state of the United States. Now give me every employee, <laughs> every attorney, <clears throat> and all of those that are weekend warriors that happen to be employed as mandatory reporters, yes, judges, justices, and oaths of office, <laughs> I will take your pension. <clears throat> I will take every fucking asset right now. Because I have the legal right to sue every National Guard that refuses to defend the state constitutions, that requires that they have to defend my rights as an American citizen. Now, as I mentioned, I'm feeling very revivalist today. <laughs> I wanted to have some revival meetings where I could preach the gospel, and you decided that you'd fuck up my background. Yes. <laughs> You'd stick me with uh, $400,000 of child support and welfare expenses? Yes. <laughs> and then when I was supposed to get a job and pay the garnishment for child support, <laughs> you were going to obstruct my right to get an ordained in any denomination of the United States of America. Now, there's certain religious needs that I have <laughs> where, let's say, I wanted to be involved in ministry and I wanted to work with children. Yes. But you have a protection order against me, and you said that I was... Uh, a child abuser? Right. I did seven hours of parenting classes and my record's been expunged. <laughs> but you said that I could not work with children. Yes, I couldn't preach the gospel of the gee whiz. <laughs> now, I'm going to sue this state and every state for not requiring the protections of my religious freedom. Yes, so that I could grab the podium. Pooch, I could speak to the congregation. Ooh. Now, as an individual that was licensed as a missionary, yes, he was, as somebody that did speak to Northwest University student body, yes, I'm making absolutely fucking sure that today it's triple damages, the fraud, yes, of depriving me the right to be ordained in any denomination of the United States of America. Now, when I get to suing each and every state of this great nation for refusing to defend the Constitution of the their individual states, any civil, well, any National Guard, yes, he did, that does not realize that my anointing needs an outlet, that I'm going to need a podium, yes, he, that I'm going to want to speak to those that want to hear. Now, today, you fucking up my personal life means I'm going to sue you for violating my right to, ooh, it's going to be some big losses, <laughs> some triple damage. <laughs>